Hey guys, what is up? It is PS of Prestige, and today I'm here again playing Rollercoaster Tycoon World Beta. And today we're gonna talk about the foliage in this game. So we're gonna go straight to scenery, and in here we can see the bushes and plant. We see foliage, and we see trees. Now, basically, uh, brushes and plant, uh, bushes and plants. Uh, right here we have the Atari top, uh, topiary, and this is basically just a little product placement for them, I guess. Uh, their logo in the game. This hedge just looks weird, and uh, I don't know why anyone would place that. Anyhow, what we can see here is a small hedge, and this small hedge looks pretty cool. Uh, I just gotta say, you know, the leaves, uh, it's very well done. It's probably very high poly, but, you know, in this engine, it's that's you're, you're just able to do that. And what you can see here is we have these hedges, and these hedges actually align, and you can place them like that, which is very cool. Right now, you just have a big hedge. Uh, you can also rotate them and probably like align them like that. Uh, they don't really touch that well right there, but I'm sure there's a way to do that. Uh, also, the big hedge, a little bigger. As you can see, it's a little taller and a little bit wider. But yeah, that's just those are the hedges you have, and I think um, these hedges they look very realistic, and the rest of the plants as well. So right here we have this uh, barrel cactus. And yeah, I'm a really big fan of this. Um, I think you're supposed to like put this either in a planter or something like that. Maybe a pot. I don't know. Uh, right here we have some simple um, cacti, I suppose. And right here we have the rounded hedges. <clears throat> and these hedges, they look pretty cool. Uh, like I said, all these hedges, they just have very pretty leaves. And they did the leaves very well. And that's just one of the things that I really like. Some trees that look like they're made of paper, but you know, for most part, this foliage just looks great. So right here we have a lot and a lot of plants. As you can see, this list is pretty big and you even have some flower beds. So let's go ahead and get started in the, uh, in the front of the menu. Right here we have some simple flowers and they look very nice, to be honest, uh, in my opinion. Of course, if you want to share your opinion about them, maybe you think they look like crap. Um, go ahead and, you know, give me a good argument about it. But right now, I think this looks very good compared to the other roller coasters, uh, the in-game plants, basically. They learned a lot from the community, I think, uh, when it comes to foliage. All right, so as you can see, they look very nice. Biscuits. All right, we have all these different kind of plants and one looks better than the other I don't really like uh, this one right here the uh, gold mounts Peria but that's just you know it's it's all personal preference but I think they did a, very, a pretty good job at making this scenery ferns and just some uh, ground shrubbery I guess medium and big which is very nice and desert grass Yucca tree, desert flower. Now I must say that this makes the game uh, lag a lot in, uh, for me. The foliage is pretty heavy on the game, so that's just something. Uh, the desert bush, which looks pretty strange. Um, but yeah, these are basically just all the plants they have. And right here they actually have gardens, and these gardens look very nice. As you can see, it's basically a flower bed with some flowers and some hedges and all that stuff. It's, it looks pretty cool in this one as well. Maybe for a plaza or something like that, it's pretty cool. Now what you have here is actually, <coughs> excuse me, I'm a, I'm a little bit ill, so my voice is kind of, kind of rough. All right, right here we have a flower bed, and these flower beds are very nice. Now they're not recolorable, but you have them in different colors. As you can see, we have this one, and we have this one. There we go. And you have this for basically <coughs> every single shape there is. Uh, so we have round ones, and we have square beds, and we have borderless beds and we have this for every color basically all three color sets and I hope they make this uh, recolorable so you can make your own combinations <coughs> which would be very nice so yeah this is basically all the flower beds that are that are in the game as of now there might be more coming uh, we don't know that yet we'll have to find out in the final release moving on to the trees we have some trees in here uh, starting out the palm trees and the bamboo. I think the bamboo looks pretty good. Uh, same with the palm trees. Actually, every tree kind of looks good. Um, let's see if we have 
We're just gonna place all the trees that are in there. Just to see how they are. I really like the way they did the foliage in this game. I'm just saying. It really looks good, in my opinion. Alright, the Douglas fir. That looks very well, uh, very nice as well. We have a sequoia tree, which is huge. Alright. A jack pine. Which is kind of blown over. <clears throat> An oak tree. Which looks very nice and fat. Um, even though the leaves are kind of... Kind of strange, as you can see. Well, actually, there we go. But the leaves are, in fact, a little bit strange. Uh, they ha they behave in a strange way, and they kind of look like they're made from paper. So they kind of look like sheets. But, you know, these trees... Uh, not every texture is as good as the other. But when you zoom in, you can actually see the detail. And the detail on these trees is pretty magnificent. They're, they're pretty good. Alright, now, apple tree... Which is, uh, I think it's a little weird. Looks a little weird. And then we have these. A poplar tree. Cypress. And a small cypress. It's kind of like a cypress sapling. Uh, I don't really like the way these look. Just because they're kind of, there's a big contrast between the lit side and the unlit side. And this is a little, a little strange, in my opinion. And as you can see, the shadows, they were great in this game. But that's basically, <clears throat> this is all the scenery, uh, all the foliage that you have right now. And I think, looking at this, I really think this game has some potential. Uh, we're going to have to see how they do it in the final release. Uh, or maybe in the next beta when it comes out, or something like that. Um, but I think this game really has some potential. I can't wait to see where it, where it goes. Uh, same for Planet Coaster, only I haven't seen anything from that game, really. Well, we haven't seen anything. And this game, you know, it's, I mean, it's it's way not finished, and they have a couple of uh, weeks, basically, to uh, to fix everything, and I don't think they'll make it, but the game definitely has some potential, so in time, it's going to be a pretty good game. Now, what I'm going to go into next episode is actually the terraforming tool, and after that, we'll go ahead and build some coasters, and uh, yeah, <coughs> so uh, this was everything for the foliage. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Um... Let me know what you think about it, and I'll see you guys in the next video, the terraforming video. So, yeah, until then, peace from Pieces of Prestige.